it's time for us to summarize all the important points that we have studied so far in this chapter. An equation of the form ax plus py plus c equal to 0 where a, b and c are real numbers such that a and b are not both 0 is called a linear equation in two variables. So what we can say is an equation of the form ax plus by plus c equal to 0 represents a linear equation if a, b, c are real numbers and a and b are not both zeros simultaneously. It's called a linear equation in two variables. A linear equation in two variables has infinitely many solutions. So if we have a linear equation in two variables then it has got infinitely many solutions. This is contrary to the fact that a linear equation in one variable has a unique solution. x equal to 0 is the equation of the y axis and y equal to 0 is the equation of the x axis. So if we have to write the equation of y axis then that is represented by x equal to 0 as all the points on the y axis has the abscissa or the x value equal to 0. Similarly, the equation of the x axis is y equal to 0. So, all the points on the x axis have the ordinate or the y value equal to 0. The graph of a linear equation in two variables is a straight line. So, the graph of every linear equation in two variables would always be a straight line. The graph of x equal to a is a straight line parallel to y axis. So if we have x equal to a as any line, then this is a straight line and it is parallel to the y axis. Also this line x equal to a is at a distance of a units from the y axis. So the equation of a line parallel to y axis is represented by x equal to a. Similarly, the graph of y equal to a is a straight line parallel to the x axis. So y equal to a is a line which is parallel to the x axis and it is also at a distance of a units from the x axis. So if we have to write the equation of a line parallel to x axis then such a line has an equation y equal to a where a is the distance between the x axis and the required line. Every point on the graph of a linear equation in two variables is a solution of the linear equation. Moreover, every solution of the linear equation is a point on the graph of linear equation. So what we can say is that every point on the graph of a linear equation in two variables is actually a solution of the linear equation. Also, every solution of the linear equation is represented on the graph of the linear equation. So every point on the graph of the linear equation is actually the solution of a linear equation. So that was all about linear equations in two variables. Linear equations form a very integral part of algebra and this chapter is definitely going to help you out in your higher studies. So try to practice as many problems as you can on this chapter. Practicing would help you to understand all the concepts more clearly.